Hey guys, it's Ezekiel here, and today I have a quick video for you on how to repair a Phoenix in Command Block Hell. Alright, so a little while ago, if you were following me on Twitter, you would know that I created what's called a Discord, and it's essentially, if you've ever heard of TeamSpeak, a little thing that basically allows you to have chat and uh, voice, voice chat and text chat uh, with basically open chat rooms for any type of server you want. So in this case, I have my own channel on here, and I have an invite link um, right here. And if you would like to go ahead and join, it will be go ahead. It'll be in the uh, video description below. However, first I'm going to go ahead and explain to you guys how you get Discord set up. All right. So the first thing is my one of my requirements for you to use this uh, is for you to create an account. Discord can be used without an account. However, if you don't have an account, I am not going to give you help because this is something I need, and I will kind of explain why later, or it'll be clear. All right. So first thing, you're gonna go to Discord. Dot gg and once you go to that you'll notice it will redirect you to this page right here so what i want you to do is click on login in the top right and then after it goes ahead and loads up this login page click register go ahead and create your account so say i want to uhm dot uhm dot us um username whatever and then password whatever the heck i want it to be and you're just going to go through those steps the next thing is, and this is something that I highly recommend, however it isn't necessarily required, download for Windows. This is a really small download, and even on my uh, hard drive with less than 200 gigabytes, I managed to store this thing. You could also do a browser version of it. So say I wanted to do this, I could then go ahead here and join, and you'll notice once this loads, um, I could then go ahead and add. And so if I type in this link here, all of a sudden, boom, I've joined my server. And say I wanted to join the voice channel of my own thing, I could do that. And uh, yeah, so now I'm actually talking there. And I should probably mute my audio because you might be hearing me twice now. But yeah, you'll notice here what you could do. And actually, I can't actually do anything in this quite yet. So yeah, once you've downloaded the Windows version anyway, press plus and join a server. Type in the link. It's pretty simple. Uh, and you have to verify your email before you can chat on this. I just did that because it's possible to spam if you don't do that, so sorry about that, but I had to enable that just a minute ago. Alright, so in order to share your Minecraft world with me, uh, and kind of go ahead and explain, there are a couple things you need to do. Alright, so the first thing is, I want to go ahead and explain this kind of tier system, and just bear with me, because it's ve something very, very simple. So you'll notice here, and I'm actually going to, um, to ban myself, um, because I don't want an extra version of myself. You'll notice here that I have a bunch of people, and I have them categorized into two categories, IRL friends and internet friends. Now, if you are going to be chatting in Command Block hel Help, I'm like 98% sure you're going to be an internet friend. So what I need you to do is go to Command Block Help, and then I want you, actually, sorry, not Command Block Help. I'm gonna have you go to General right here, and I'm going to have you go ahead and type a couple of things in. First thing is I want you to write YouTube username colon whatever because if you have a YouTube account then you're probably going to be uh, talking to me so I want to know what your YouTube username is so I, if I see you in the comments I know who you are and basically once you've done that next time I log on to Discord I'll be able to then actually right click on you and then go to roles and I could set your roles in this case this is an IRL friend so you'll notice IRL friend is selected and these private channels are something that I will maybe go over later, but they're not super important. But anyways, so yeah, you can go ahead and chat in here. Make sure you have general selected, and just press enter to send a message. Alright, so next, once you are, uh, you should necessarily, sorry, you should be able to do go to command block help no matter what. And what I want you to do here is go ahead and click, um, click open your Windows Explorer outside of Discord. I did not mean to open that inside Discord, but anyways, yeah, you'll notice right now I've opened up my Explorer. I'm going to go to percent, so percent sign, app data, percent. So once you've done that, you will see over down here dot Minecraft. Click on that. You're also then going to click on save, and then you're going to find your world save. And your world save hopefully is named, so in my case it would be my command block tutorial, and you're going to right click on it, send to zip folder. Once you have done this, you'll notice it'll say compressing, and in just a quick minute here, all of a sudden we have a file named one underscore ten command tutorial dot zip. 
So now that we have this file, what we're going to do is go ahead here and press the upload button. Again, we're going to head to percent app dot uh, eh, app dot uh, percent and go to dot minecraft save and we are going to find this file which is uh where is it 110 command block trail okay and press open next i want you to add a comment again which uh this comment is something very very specific first off uh write your youtube username then you're going to write what you need help on be very specific uh and I'll explain why in a sec. Alright, so the reason you need to be very, very specific about this is because you could ask for help, but I won't know exactly what you're talking about. The other thing is, it'll automatically put me at your world spawn point, so I, if there are any coordinates of a specific place uh, where you need help, please put those coordinates in, uh, because otherwise I will have no idea where to go. So what I would like you to specify is basically... Um, you know, if it's a chain of command blocks, if it's repeating, what specifically you need help with. And this will essentially be a way for me to communicate with you, the audience, uh, in a way that I'm able to go ahead and either voice chat with you if I'm on, which is pretty rare, or I can go ahead and download your world and see what's going on. By the way, if you do go ahead and try and upload a virus to this, then you will promptly be banned and muted, and I think there's probably a way to report you. Um, I have a virus detection software, so don't even try to do that. Um, and so yeah, again, YouTube username, what you need help on, uh, being very specific, and also, yeah, if there's anything else I need to know, any other information, uh, and then what you could go ahead and do here after you upload the file, and <laughs> here are all the keyboard combos if you ever wanted to know those. Um, huh, that's cool. Not sure why that popped up. Anyways, yeah, now that we know this, we have this here. What you can go ahead and do here is, oh wait, nickname. So you could actually change your nickname at any time. So what I want you to go ahead and do is just keep your nickname appropriate. Again, I will ban you and like you won't get any help if you keep your, if you have it inappropriate. So what you can go ahead and do actually here is you could send people friend requests. So the way you're going to do that is you're going to right click on the person's name and you'll see an add friend button. Uh, I want you to go ahead and do that simply so that you can direct message me. However, actually <laughs> one more thing about the nickname, what I want you to do, uh, unless you are using Discord for something else, go ahead and write the, um, write something Write a character after your name with a space so that I know that you're specifically asking for help, like H for help, for example. So AFK dash wave H is just something that's really helpful to know because first off, I am able to know who you are. And again, I'm going to correlate. I might actually rename you if uh, it is necessary because I believe it or not, within this channel, I could give you a specific username. Like say, for example, I didn't like Lulu K Tarantino's username. I could actually go ahead and change the nickname uh, which makes it visible to everyone on the server. So please just keep the names normal, or I will change it for you. And so yeah, again, just name, add the letter H after your name, and send me a friend request. And from there, you can actually direct message. Uh, so unless, like, say, for example, I go to Luke Tarant 2, I could right click, click message, and send Luke Tarant 2 a message, uh, or Docker or whatever. Actually, I just realized. I don't think I have Docker as a friend. So actually, that is probably a perfect example to try and show how to add someone as a friend. So let me go to here and let's go, where was it? Oh, here it is. So there's Josh Bird right here. I'm going to go to, uh, never mind, he is a friend. He's just not on my channel anymore. So I'm going to press uh, add and you'll notice now it says invite sent. So uh, it you'll now ha he now has an invite to join the channel. Uh, I believe that you will be able to invite anyone, but I'm not sure about that. I'll double check on that later. And next I'm going to move on on how to do it on Mac, so please stay because there will be some other important information at the end here. So if you are on Mac, and I'm just going to give you a quick little voice tutorial because I don't have a very specific tutorial. What you're going to do here is you're going to open your Minecraft launcher. And once you have opened your Minecraft launcher, obviously yours will look different than mine, but you'll still have this bottom bar here. You're going to click Edit Profile and Open Game VIR. 
this will bring you straight to your Minecraft folder. And then you can go ahead here and navigate to your saved folder. And when you right click on the save this time, it'll say something like compress rather than send to zip. So you could go ahead and do that. And after you have done that, uh, I want you to go ahead and go into the Discord web app. If there is no Discord for Mac, I'm pretty sure there is Discord for Mac though. And go ahead and just follow the same instructions as for Windows. Um, Cause I used to use a Mac myself, so that's why I know this. Um, and in terms of other information, yeah, so I'm just going to give you a quick rundown of how Discord works. All right, so I'm actually going to uh, unmute. All right, so you'll notice here the way Discord works is there are multiple voice channels. So first off, I have the general channel. The general channel is a channel that anybody who is on this uh, server can access. So what this means is essentially that if you want to go ahead and talk to someone else, you can go into general, and this is one that is really important. We're on the internet, so do not share your real name or just any other information but your name. Uh, I'm perfectly fine if you like share your name, but ideally not if you're like an IRL friend because I don't want to compromise your safety. It's just basic, basic internet safety 101. Command block help right here. So this is something that's important for you to know about. And actually, I'm going to temporarily rename myself back to Wave. Um, so you'll notice command block dash help has a voice channel and has a text channel. So the text channel is where you need to paste your help. If you post it in the general channel, I will remove your comment and just send you a quick reminder that it must be in the command block help section. And the command block help voice channel is basically a channel where I will sometimes be there to help you. And it'll also be a channel where if you want to help other people with command blocking or just kind of have a discussion, you could do it there. You could also have discussions in general um, or say internet friends. And AFK is just a channel where you're not allowed to talk. And uh, yeah, you'll notice that I can't talk at all, even though I'm the owner of this. I can't talk there, and it'll automatically be moved there if nothing happens for a while. So just something important to know if you're trying to uh, to talk and then you realize nothing's coming out, it's probably because you're in the wrong channel. Just something to know. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. If there's anything else that's important to know, I will go ahead and leave it on screen right now or in the description or something. Again, here is the link. You should probably pause the video right now and copy it. Probably have it somewhere. In the video course and yeah so i hope you enjoyed this kind of extra little um bonus video the reason i did this is because i have an extra day this week and i or and i know most of you viewers also have an extra day off of school this week which is really awesome so when i have days like this i'm going to try and create multiple videos whether it's a tutorial like this or whether it's something like um i don't know say uh, I might start my advanced command block tutorial series. Um, <laughs> no, uh, no spoilers on when that's going to start. But yeah, guys, I hope you have enjoyed. Once again, uh, here's the link. And subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching. Bye.